They're telling me what they know about themselves is if they go to little Ricky and little Janet's softball games and recitals, and if they hang out with them and play Wii with them all day, that that's what's gonna make them happy, and then they think they're sending me an email because I'm business guy, and I'm gonna tell them that's wrong. Are you out of your fucking mind? People lose because they think it's gonna happen fast when life is long. And so I've been spending a lot of time on this just watching behaviors. Who's winning? Who's winning is the person that likes what they do. It's true. Like how many more fucking millionaires do I have to hang out with that are gonna take their life or in deep depression or doing drugs and alcohol to deal with the pain? Because making $2.3 million a year brings them zero fucking happiness. And how many people do I have to hang out with that make 87,000 a year that sell Smurf t-shirts on the internet and love fucking life? You like that one? It's good. You gonna sell some Smurf t-shirts? <laughs> Go with Alf, open market. Shit's getting very clear for me. Maybe it's because I'm getting older now, but shit's getting very clear to me. It's pattern recognition. Life is very basic. We make it unbelievably complicated. We're unbelievably products of the DNA and the parents and the environment we grew up on. And we have to really understand that so we know how to navigate the next step. People lack the ability to put their life in perspective. I've been pushing people lately who are 43-year-old entrepreneurs sending me emails and they have a six-year-old child. They love their business, they're killing it. Things are going great. And my advice to them is to slow down and take the next 12 years and actually, because they're telling me what they know about themselves is if they go to little Ricky and little Janet's softball games and recitals and if they hang out with them and play Wii with them all day, that that's what's gonna make them happy and then they think they're sending me an email because I'm business guy and I'm gonna tell them that's wrong. Are you out of your fucking mind? You need to be happy and if you're self-aware enough to know that at 43 years old, you have six-year-old kids that you wanna spend the next 12 years taking the foot off the pedal so you can allocate time to watch those kids grow, I've got tremendous news for you. You're just gonna be 55 and a baby when they go to college and they're not gonna wanna talk to you anyway and you're gonna be able to go all in. <laughs> Do you know how liberating it is when people understand how young 59 years old is? Do you know how many people think they're supposed to have their life figured out at 18, 22, and 30? when the parents that are putting pressure on them to figure out their lives don't have their lives figured out? <laughs> oh, I like that one. <laughs> How the fuck are you supposed to have your whole life figured out at 28 years old? It's ludicrous. We have such interesting macro theses in our society that are crippling people and the reason there's so much anxiety in the system now is we're all living our lives in public forums and now taking on more judgment, not less. I don't hear any of you. Let me say it one more time. How many people here fuck with my content and they love it? Let me hear you. Can't hear you. Can't hear you. <laughs> Let me say it one more time. For all the people here who think I fucking walk on water, I'm the best, I'm such a great dude, I can't fucking hear you. Let me explain why. Not you, bro. <laughs> Let me explain to you why I can't hear you. Because I have no interest on getting high on my own supply. The reason, the reason I can't hear you is the same reason that I can't hear the person that leaves a comment that says I'm a snake oil salesman or my cursing is inappropriate or I suck or I'm gonna burn out or whatever else. I can't hear that fuck face either. <laughs> and when, over the next 50 years of my life, I figure out how to produce more communications to help you not hear it either, that is when I will start having more significant impact because when you don't hear anything, and I don't mean from just fatty pants 63. I mean from your dad. I mean from your spouse. When you, my friends in Phoenix on a Wednesday going into 2019, when you stop hearing things, shit gets remarkable. <laughs>